Hey guys, in this video, I really want to show you where we're at on the apartment because I feel like I've sort of left you in the dark with just like the apartment. I got it, I talked about it, and then all of a sudden it was like poof, no more talking about it. And it's truly because it's not even close to being done with the wedding coming up and getting married within four months. Oh my gosh. Trying to like make it feel like home is just very difference especially because it's not like a super modern apartment like we've definitely had to do a lot of work to it to just like make it I mean it's nice you guys are gonna see and I'll show you what we have going on so far and also like the vision that I have the first thing I'll show you are our couches and like the whole living room so Zenus actually came in clutch for us so Zenus is um, they sell a bunch of different furniture they're like an online retailer um, where everything is just super easy to assemble and it comes straight to your door well we had a couch mishap so we got two couches off the Facebook market site and we actually got it from a pastor and so I thought, you know, I thought everything was fine. And then we pay for a U-Haul, we go pick it up. Actually, my fiance picks it up. This is not my fault. We bring it back, we sit in it, and we fall straight to the floor. It was like the biggest mishap ever. And so we ended up having to get rid of those couches. And luckily, Zenus came in clutch. They sent us one couch, an ottoman, and two chairs, which was really, really nice because we didn't have any furniture in this place for a while. We're a little bit backlit here because I have a big window right here. And then we also have a window back here. But this is what the couch looks like. I'll show you like an overlay, uh, but I can't show you flat on or else the camera is going to be weird with the lighting. But this is awesome because the ottoman isn't attached. You can put it over here if you want. This definitely has more of a futon feel versus like a really cozy couch that you're going to watch a movie in. And for that reason, I might actually move this into my office, which I'll show you. And then we got these chairs right here. These ones are very much like lounging chairs. Like these, you just kind of sink into it. So these will be staying in here. So I'll go ahead and I'll link Zenas down below in case you guys are interested. They're really affordable and they come straight to your door, which is really nice, especially if you live alone or if your partner works or something like that. That's That was the situation we were in. And so the fact that it just comes in a box straight to our door was just perfect. So I'll link that down below if you guys are interested, but yeah. This is the living room. We have our TV up on a mantle. We want to mount this at some point. We love that there's a fireplace. We'd love to utilize that. Also, I never mentioned that I painted this entire place. It came and it was like such, like it was like a yellowy orange color on the walls and I just wasn't about it. I do, I'll show you. I do not understand why apartment complexes don't just paint their walls either like a very light gray or like a white. I just, I don't understand. Over here we have a little bookshelf. I actually want to get a way bigger bookshelf. Like I have a vision of, I don't know, it's just like being tall. Like I really want like a tall bookshelf that takes up the whole wall. We have a little plant here. Over here we have, I know it's really kind of hard to see, um, we have like a little entertainment stand where I kind of just keep random office stuff. Eventually I think I might be taking this into my office. These yeah, I don't know. I want photos in there. I love this chair being here. This is the dining room. There is so much work that needs to be done here. And then as of right now, it's just been used as storage for all of the wedding flowers. And these are just flowers for the reception. Like that is it. Um, I'm still working. I really want like a big flower arch for the wedding. And so that has just been a work in progress. And this table and honestly this painting, pretty much everything in here is going to go at some point. I don't like the table. It was like a temporary thing, again, just because I needed furniture in here ASAP. The bedroom as of right now is my favorite place just because it is so bright. I just love how much light gets into this room. Like I kind of wish that this was going to be my office, but I knew that that just wasn't fair to Alex because I'm going to be spending so much time in my office and I knew that he deserves a master bedroom <laughs> where we actually do get enough light. This nightstand right here is my favorite, so I really wanna get one on this side for Alex because this is gonna be my side and this is gonna be his. Um, we still need to figure out dressers for here, but I love how white it is. I actually painted this. Um, I don't know, I literally saw a painting just like this for over $700 and so I was like, I can paint this. So I did. We still need to figure out a dresser situation uh, because I have my dresser. My closet and my dresser is going to move into the office just because again, I'm gonna be in there most of the time I work from home. And so we need to figure out, he has a lot of clothes. We need to figure out something, but we have so much space in here. So much space. Yeah, I use this as of right now as like my makeup area. The attached bathroom is going to be Alex's, same with the closet in here. And I'm gonna take the ones closer to the office because 
it's just where I'm going to be most of the time. And eventually I'm gonna add a lot more storage. So we've added those and some hooks back here, but I really wanna add some storage here. Here's our entryway. It is pretty boring right now. I really wanna add like a really cute uh, wooden console table with a lamp, um, maybe like a mirror, and then obviously a place to have shoes. This has turned into our wedding closet. So a lot of the flowers that you saw out there are going to be pushed into here when everything is out and about. I mean, honestly, this is probably still going to be a wedding closet even months after the wedding because I'm going to have to take some time to sell everything. The kitchen isn't very extravagant by any means. We knew going into this that our very first home wasn't going to be extravagant. Um, we're just being realistic. We're two ordinary, young, broke kids that are moving into our first home. And so it's nothing really extravagant. I know eventually I would like to get into a place where we have a nicer kitchen, but for right now this works. I think we are also going to put like, um, what is that called? You can basically wrap your counters and make them look like fake marble. So I think we might do that just to spruce it up a little bit, but yeah, it is nothing special in here. I'm a little hesitant to show you the office because the office is like just not, like this has been our junk room until we're able to get like a we need a place for everything and then i also need to throw stuff out because i just have so much and alex is also going to have so much and so we just need to like condense our stuff and so this has turned into like the condensing room we have a huge walk-in closet which is going to be my closet uh and then i also just picked up my wedding dress which is fun but i mean this room is big it's nice it's a beautiful size um, soon, like I said, it, it's a work in progress. We have a rug coming and then over here I really want to put like a big mirror so I could do my Instagram stories a lot a lot I just need to throw stuff out like we have so much junk like I seriously have so much stuff in here It's just like junk like literally I have bags from whenever I Was almost cast to be the bachelor like they gave us bags like I'm holding on to all of that why I'm holding on to it I I don't know I just think it's cool. Like who else gets to say that they were almost cast to be on The Bachelor, you know? And so I just hold on to it because it's fun. And um, I don't know, we have like shoe organizers and all that. The last thing that I need to show you is our laundry room, which really isn't that exciting if I'm being honest. Um, and right now we're using it kind of as like a bridal suite. I have, I think there's like 16 dresses. I think that's what me and Alex counted. Oh, and the bathroom. I didn't even, I mean, it's really not that exciting. So this bathroom is a little bit larger than the other one. Um, we have the shower curtain. I need to get a new rug because my self tanner may or may not have stained it. We have some extra storage here. I need to switch out the light bulbs because they're just, not only are they really bright, but they're really yellow. We have some more storage here just for like products and whatnot. Same looks as the last bathroom. And I mean, that's about it. Like this, like we knew going into this that our first home wasn't going to be anything crazy extravagant. And it's not. I wouldn't say that this place is extravagant, but we are definitely working to make it feel like home. We painted, like I said, I might do the DIY marble countertop hat, like countertop hack. Um, we're definitely gonna get some rugs in here. Um, I don't know if you guys have any other suggestions on how to make this place feel home um, Or feel like home. I'm all ears. I also really want to do um, Like like I don't know like a gallery wall with photos of our wedding or of our engagement photos I don't know. I want to do that. So let me know. I'm open to absolutely any suggestions that you guys have. So that's about it. Okay. Bye